Why is it stopping? I have no idea. It just does that. Sometimes I'll sit here and I'll do a whole video and I'll get up and I don't understand say, why you, you, don't, you don't use your other camera now. Well, I've never tried. That's why. That's what I had planned for this week. Hi! We get on so well. Hey guys, welcome to Inspiration365. I have brought my extremely sensible and clever husband with me today. Thanks for the invite. Yeah, the people wanted you. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do a bit of a couples q and I thought it might be interesting for you guys to ask us some questions as a couple, get a little bit of a feel for who we are as a couple. So I asked you on Facebook what you wanted to know and here are some of the questions. So question number one from Holly. How do you balance work life and quality time with Joel? I can't answer that for you. Um, I don't balance it very well. It's 10 to 11 now and we've been working all day and here we are still working and but it doesn't feel like work. That's nice. That's the trouble with all of this is that it doesn't feel like work so it's very hard to know when to stop. We're having too much fun. Too much fun. So much fun is killing us. Basically we try and have fun whilst we're working. We try and have fun on the road, we try and go out and eat together and mm. make the most of where we are. Yeah, that's great. I agree. Max asks, what's the best gig you two have ever done? And I think we can, either of us or both can answer. Probably the Live Aid. <laughs> live Aid? Well you said the best gig that you two have ever done. So I'm guessing Live Aid. When did we do Live Aid? What are you talking about? You don't get it. Oh, you two. Yeah, I'm too tired. We did like an arena gig in Holland and we played it in the middle of the, the whole arena with 25,000 people. And that was fun. And it was fun seeing all our gear rotating and then going up conveyor belts. I will link the video to that in the description. It was called EO Youth Day and it was epic. What was your favourite gig? There have been plenty of favourite gigs. Oh, our oh son wants our attention. And so. I think my favourite gig was either that one or some of the shows we did with the Little Mix were incredible because all the teenagers just spontaneously mm. got their phones out and their lights out and, and just filled the place with light. But there have been so many good ones, it's so hard to pick one, but they are some of the best. Ilsa Darby, do you ever have discouragements and how do you resolve them? And a question for Joel, do you miss doing things with the guys? Yes, I do miss playing with the boys. I used to be in a band called The Gentleman. Four piece, rock, indie, funk. All of the above. Yeah, I was in there for 10 years, uh, played some great gigs. But you know, life goes on. We all do our own thing now. When I have a band on the road, it all gets to hang out with those guys. Disagreements. How do we resolve how, them? How do we resolve our disagreements? Uh, cups of teas. Cups of teas, <laughs> watching our favourite shows. Yeah. We've learned actually to talk things through. It's so uncomfortable to go on stage in the midst of a disagreement. You just kind of have to put it to bed. And it's so uplifting playing music. Anger really does subside when you've had a great show and you've felt the love in the room. Zoe says, what's the best thing about touring today? Together. It saves money because... Yeah, it's cheap, isn't it? We're in one, <laughs> one room, we only need one bed. I don't have to hire a drummer. Or a driver, or a merch guy, or a band liaison, or tour manager. No, it's just all me. I don't do anything. You don't do anything, you just sing. I just sing and write songs and books and content and do YouTube every day. Okay. Lisa says, what do you both individually do for each other and together to encourage your personal faith? Mm, give you some hugs. You don't like hugs, don't you? Uh, we have a lot of discussions and we pray, so... We do pray, actually. Pray before gigs, pray before actually when we go on stage. Sometimes when we walk the dog, we pray about the stuff we're worried about. Pray in the car, we pray in the shops. I thought you were going to say we pray in the shower. We do pray in the shower, individually. Well, actually, I actually make beats. In play, the shower? Yeah, I play drums with my mouth. I think we should like move beats. on from this question. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, anyway, yeah, so we pray together, we discuss things, and we're really open and honest. I always tell Joel when I'm having a hard time, and he's very consistent. Extremely. What were your first impressions of each other? She was delightful. She was elegant and a radiant unicorn. <laughs> I thought Joel was the quietest person in history. I I've said this a lot of times. Just way too squeaky clean and perfect for a mess like me. And now look at me, still the same. Now we've switched. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you know, first impressions were that he was a good person and he was worth getting to know. Ah, huh, that's good to know. And a great drummer, great musician. Thanks. What are our views on sex before marriage? Um... Bit, people just, that's all the world to see. 
Do a love heart with me. With you. Thumbnail. All right. I think you should crack screen. It's doing something weird. I'll crack your screen in a minute. <laughs> Just saying the obvious. Disagreements.